If you're a creative small business owner who works on event-based projects like weddings, chances are you find yourself having a lot of one-off questions for your clients that if asked one by one, add up to quite a few emails back and forth. One of the best solutions that we've found to cut down on the number of emails, both for us and for our clients, is by sending a client questionnaire. And we do this through our client relationship management software, HoneyBook, which we absolutely love. So today on Bite Size Business, we're gonna walk you guys through exactly how we create a client questionnaire that we send via HoneyBook, which will cut down on the information gathering process, both for you and your client. This is Bite Size Business, where we're helping entrepreneurs become the hero of their own creative small business. I'm your host, Abby Grace, and this is my husband, Matt, also my business manager. I'm an international photographer who also loves educating for creative small business owners. So here on Bite Size Business, we do a lot of strategy for creative small business owners, as well as tips and tricks for the growing photographer. So if that sounds like your brain of strawberry jam, make sure you guys hit subscribe. So let's talk about questionnaires. I'm a wedding photographer, so one of the best ways that I use questionnaires is in helping me prep for the wedding. Yes, it definitely helps cut down on the number of emails that I have to send my client and the number of emails that I have to wait for them to send back to me, but there are so many more benefits for that with me when it comes to the wedding day. So Matt's the one who sends those questionnaires over to our clients. We send them how many days out before the wedding? 30 days out. And so you set, Matt sets a Google notification on our calendar when we book a new client. He goes ahead and fast forwards however many months backtracks one month from the wedding and sets a notification in Google Calendar to go ahead and send that client questionnaire. So what do we use the questionnaire for when it comes to weddings? So it helps us gather information for the day of the wedding so we know where we're going, um, exactly the addresses of where we're going. It helps us know who the important people are to contact and who we need to focus on at the wedding. Yeah, we also use our pre-wedding questionnaire, just as an example, to gather the family formal list. So rather than having to have another conversation with my couples, ask them again to take more time out of their day we use the pre-wedding questionnaire to gather everything from GPSs to, sorry, GPSs, GPSs, we don't gather those from our clients, to gather addresses to type into Google Maps on our way to the wedding, on our way to the reception. We gather family formals. We ask our clients what special details they're using. We use that pre-wedding questionnaire as a general catch-all for everything that we need to go ahead and prepare for the wedding day. So since Matt is the one who sends those for our business, he's going to go ahead and walk you through step by step exactly how to set up a client questionnaire within HoneyBook. Trust me, this is going to make your life so much easier. Just a quick heads up, we are including an affiliate link in the show notes below, which if you choose to use it, will result in a small commission for us to continue creating awesome content just like you see on our YouTube channel. You guys know I only share products and companies that I believe in and trust, so know that I will always send you to sources that I count on as reliable. Take it away, Matt. All right, so to create a questionnaire, we'll start by going up here to tools, and you come over here to templates, and down here to questionnaire, and so HoneyBook already has a template pre-populated here. They have a couple of them. If you click this button here that you could use, um, but you also can create your own here. And then you can actually change this picture on any template. Uh, you can either scroll through like this and click here and you can upload your own image. You can use one of the ones that HoneyBook has already pre-populated. Um, so we'll go ahead and use one of the ones I've uploaded. And here you can change just how much is shown um, and where on the image it's shown here. And then you just hit save. And then it pops up right here. So here you can actually add a little welcome message. Just thanks for the information. Um, just a little nice added touch here. First question is you can type out here. So we'll say, you know, what is the location of your getting ready ceremony and reception? And then we can make that a required question, which puts a little asterisk here to denote that it's required. So that way they have to fill it out in order to submit the questionnaire. And then you can come on and add questions. So you can do it with one line of text, um, a text area, which is a longer text area. Um, radio buttons so they can only choose one of the options, check boxes where they can choose one or more of the options, and then a drop down list which is similar to the radio buttons, just you only get to choose one option as well. So we'll go ahead and do a check box. So what family formal content?
combinations do you require? Check all that apply. And then you can put, you know, bride plus groom, bride's family, groom's family, groom's siblings, bride's siblings, etc. Um, so this will create nice checkboxes here for them to be able to fill out. And then we'll go ahead and add any other questions we want to. So you can just keep adding questions until you're done. So next what you'll do is you'll come up here and just rename the template so that way you know how to find it later. And there you go, we have a template created. All right, now that we have our template created, we can just hit back here. And then we'll go to projects. We can add it to the project we want to send the questionnaire for. So now all we have to do is hit new file, questionnaire. So you can either create a blank questionnaire to so start over again, or you can create one that is from a recent questionnaire, or we'll go ahead and pick our template from the pre-populated templates here. So here you see it's been added here, and you can also come down here and add a question. So let's say you had a specific question for this couple you wanted to ask. Uh, you can go ahead and add any questions here or take out any questions as well. So then once we have the questionnaire how we want it to be, we'll go ahead and hit review email. Um, and this is a pre-populated email from HoneyBook. Um, they have a couple of templates in here, but we actually already put our own template. So now all I have to do is the hi Andy and April. And then we can edit it if we need to, or we can just send it. Um, and then you can edit the subject line, just make sure. You can hit preview, and that will show us what it'll look like for the client from their perspective. So I go ahead and hit send. And this is go over to the client right now. And you can see all of our communication with the client right here. All right, this is what it's gonna look like from the client's perspective. So we'll go ahead and open the email and come down here and view the questionnaire. So everything's populated here. And you can see if I hit submit questionnaire because this one is marked with an asterisk, it will tell me that I can't submit that we need to um, put information in there because it's a required question. So, put that in, and then we'll select our family formal combinations, and then we can hit submit questionnaire. So this is important. It it tells them just a little warning that if we submit it, that we can't edit any questions afterwards. So just to make sure that this is what they want to do, hit confirm takes you to the thank you page and you can continue to your project and see what the project looks like from the client's perspective. I hope that was helpful for you guys. If you have any questions about HoneyBook, put them in the comment section below and I'd be happy to answer them for you. Like we said, HoneyBook was a game changer for us and we think it might be for you too. So we are so excited because HoneyBook's offering 50% off your first year. Just make sure you guys sign up using the link below because trust me, you're gonna fall in love. As always, as every YouTuber ever says, if you like this episode, make sure you give it a thumbs up and then definitely hit subscribe because there is so much more goodness where that came from. We'll catch you guys next time on Bite Size Business.